I've been working on a collection and API in my own personal workspace since a really long time. And I think I'd like some feedback from my teammates about it, which is why now's the time when I should create a Postman team. So let's go ahead and create a Postman team. Let's click on create a free team. I'll just go ahead and edit team profile. And for the team name, I will go ahead and call it Team Flash. and use this URL to access Postman. For now, let's just keep the team discovery off, um, which is by default. And let's actually go ahead and change the logo to my team logo, which is the flash icon. Okay, so this domain is already in use, which is one more reason why I should have created my team earlier in the first place. So let me try another one. And let me invite my teammate, Barry Allen. Yes, so the Postman team is created and if we see the slug in the address bar, it says the team flash, which is the URL that we set while creating the team. Once the team is created, there will also be a team workspace that is created. And this is the place where all of the collaboration happens. I could use this space to potentially share the collection and the API that I was working on and get feedback from my teammates.